Hello, Edwin here from 8web.com.au and today I'm going to show you how to create and send newsletters with Visija plugin for WordPress websites. Now, I'm already here logged in into my website and if you click on the Visija plugin um, a button on the side menu of your admin page, um, you'll come to your newsletter section. Now, I've got one newsletter here that I've Decide, uh, designed in the beginning and sent out a little while ago and um, today I'm going to send out a second newsletter which is this one um, before we do that um, I wanted to let you know how to create a newsletter uh, with Visija uh, it's actually quite simple once you've done the first one uh, you've got this duplicate button here and what it essentially does it basically copies the newsletter that you've sent uh, so you can modify it later and um, it names it copy off I've already done that with this one and um, so let's click on this newsletter and see how it looks now the first step is basically just um, it's a regular newsletter the title I've given it and what list it's going out to Next step actually shows the newsletter. And here I have um, how Wisija works is basically um, it has boxes of text and images that you can import from the side menu. And I've already imported that. That was in the first newsletter. That's a picture. Uh, this is a text box, as you can see. And um, if you click on it, it opens it up for editing, right? As soon as you get away from it, it closes it. If you click it anywhere else, it closes it and saves it. So I've got dividers in between the texts, and um, I've got a um, picture here that I've already hyperlinked using this button here. It's already hyperlinked to the end website of the business that I'm recommending here. and um, let's open this box because I noticed that I need to do a simple text edit. Um, we left out the article V, so that yoga hut. Um, you save that, that saves it. Beautiful. So now we have basically a newsletter that we can edit at will, and uh, you have different, um, basically, different uh, formatting styles. You, can, you have headings various size and, and shape and they come from uh, here from styles because you can edit the styles in, in, on the side here well enough of that you can learn more about this by yourself by experimenting yourself if you want to see how your newsletter looks in the browser you can click on here and that will show you what it looks like in the browser it looks good enough to me so what we're going to do now is we're going to send it. So this is step two. So let's go to step three. Next step. And that's where it will give us the option to have a look um, which, which list we're sending it to, from whom, the name, uh, and the email. So basically from name, email, 8 web newsletter and this is the email address that replies will go to um, and it gives us the option of scheduling it or sending it straight away but what we want to do we just want to send it straight away so we click on send and what happens here you will see that uh, in 10 minutes and 47 seconds 29 emails will be sent. Now we can leave it at that or um, because we're running our own VPS, virtual private server from Sydney, we are not limited by a uh, number of emails we can send out, etc. Uh, we, can, we can basically send it out uh, now. So we click on don't wait and send right now and it's going to send all the news newsletters to, to everybody. 
So here you have it. We've um, sent out uh, 29 emails out of 29 uh, for, in four-hour small list, and the newsletter sent out. And thank you very much for your attention.